everyone, today I am going to talk about beaks of birds and adaptation. What is a beak? Let's learn it in a fun way. A beak is a bird's nose and mouth. A bird uses its beak for eating, breathing, fighting and communicating. There are no teeth inside a bird's beak. The beak continuously grows. It is made up of keratin, the same material that human legs are made up of, so it doesn't stop growing. The next word is adaptation. What does it mean? The variety, size, shape of a beak dictates the bird's diet. What does it eat? So let's discuss the different types of beaks. Number 1. Strong and pointed. Woodpecker has this type of beak. Let me just show you. Suppose this is a tree park and this is woodpecker. Woodpecker acts as children and pulls out the insects from the tree trunk and eats it. The next is long, slightly curved and narrow beak. Hooper, humming and sunbird have this type of beak. Hooper bird uses its beak to pull out the insects from the holes in the grounds. Humming and sunbird use their beak to suck nectar from the flowers. The next beak is short, broad and sticky beak. Swallows have this type of beak. Swallows beak is very sticky inside. Swallows fly in the air with their mouth open and catch insects which stick inside their mouth. The next is broad, flat and spoon like beak. Ducks, swans and other water birds have this type of beak. The last beak is strong, sharp and hooked beak. Eagle, vulture and other flesh eating birds have this type of beak. Now I want to end this with an interesting fact. Australian pelicans have the longest beak in the world. Hope you had fun with me. Thank you.